That's another uh, project that uh, I'm doing, uh, which is not being presented this year at ASCO GU meeting. We have been conducting studies with soy isoflavones for many years. Uh, soy isoflavones are very interesting compounds. Uh, they're also referred to sometimes as phytoestrogens. Genistein is the prototypic compound. Uh, these compounds are selective estrogen receptor modulators, but they also uh, modulate androgen receptor. Uh, they have many uh, other biological effects, including anti-inflammatory, antioxidant uh, effects, and epigenetic effects. But we have also observed in preclinical studies that these compounds may increase the efficacy of chemotherapy and decrease the side effects of chemotherapy. This may also happen uh, with radiation therapy. We have some data that shows that soy isoflavones may also increase the efficacy of radiation and decrease the toxicity of radiation. So these are very interesting compounds. Uh, they're found in soy products, so one can easily obtain them through the diet by drinking soy milk or, or e eating soy products. Our studies show that uh, uh, these compounds they may potentially benefit patients on chemotherapy and uh, radiation therapy and even hormone therapy and other therapies by increasing the efficacy of these treatments and reduce their toxicities.